Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. Today we put together and executed yet another loyalty test. Today our mom wanna put his girlfriend Chester Ray to the loyalty test to see if she was truly loyal to him or not. Bro, so I'm, I'm assuming she working all motherfucking day. But then when it come the first of the month, bro, she never got her half of the rent. So how the fuck, like what are you, like, what are you doing? You claim you working, but you never had your half of the rent. And you wanna criticize me about what the fuck I do. And she know my little situation, so, you know what I'm saying? But I. As long as I as long as I got my half of the ring, you know what I'm saying, that's all that matters. So because she don't have her money, that's why you feel like she she fucking hey, around? Yeah, she doing something. She doing something. Like you gotta have you gotta bring something to the table, you feel me? You can't you can't you can't just be out all day and not not contrib contributing at all, bro. You gotta be doing something. It's sure. something you're doing, you feel sure. what I'm saying? Because Chester Ray comes up short for the bills, but it's always at work, that in itself is a red flag for Armand. And he began to question Chester Ray's actual whereabouts and what she actually does with her money, causing him to reach out to me. For this loyalty test, we hired Dino to be the decoy. Since Chester Ray is having money issues, I thought it would be a good idea to throw money at her. And if she is truly disloyal, this would be the perfect situation to put her in. Thanks to Armand, we knew that Chester Ray worked at this valet place in front of this fancy restaurant. We knew what time she got out of work, so we set up cameras in position to capture Dino shooting his shot. But after waiting 30 minutes when she should have already clocked out, there was no sign of Cesare. So I went in myself to get more information and this is what we found out. Hey, what's good, bro? Uh, how, how was the food and stuff there? It's very good. It's good? Yeah, it's very good. Hey, I, I, I always come here, but usually my valet person is Cesare. Where is she? Cesare? Yeah. She don't work here anymore. She don't work here no more? No. How long she haven't been working here? Like a month or that month. Oh, uh, okay, cool. It's been a long time. Right, I'm gonna come back later. All right, thanks, man. All right, I got you. Bro, she don't even fucking work here anymore, bro. So we literally just set all that up only to find out that Cesare no longer works at the valet place, and on top of that, her husband has no idea that she hasn't been working there for over a month. So what exactly have she been doing with her time? Bro, the dude at the front said she don't even work there no more. What? She said, they said she ain't been working there for a month. A motherfucking lot, bro. Where the, who, who, who the fuck said that? It was a, it was a, it was another guy at the front. Bro, hell you said this is the time she supposed to be at work, right? Nigga, she, bro, she claims she to come to this motherfucker every day, fool. She gotta be at this bitch. She not up there right now. No, she not up there. Bro, what the fuck? I'm about to call this bitch right nah, now. Nah, don't call her. Don't call her. Nigga, nah, what the fuck you mean? Don't call her, bro. Watch out with the camera, bro. The fuck you mean? Don't call her, bro. Nigga, she ain't been here. Nigga, she claims she work at this motherfucker, nigga. Why did you start recording? Bro. He was tripping, bro. So after the cameras cut off and Armand cooled down, we was able to have a cool, calm, collective conversation and we came to the agreement that we would just go ahead and go to his house and run surveillance. He then sent an address to where he and Cesare lived and me and the team went and ran surveillance. Drip, you found you a good spot? Yep, I'm in position. I see y'all pulling up now. Y'all should stop like right there. Bro, you can barely see anything. Front, 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 front. Bro, how was you late to a stakeout, bro? <laughs> I ain't know when to come, fool. It was crazy, nigga. It was cars right there, call two cars right here, so I ain't know when to come. I was like, damn, shit, should I go? I don't like how we got two cars down there and two cars down here. That shit look kind of suspicious. Right? Yeah, it looked kind of crazy, bro. So I was like, man, I don't know when to come. We should have just got one big ass van. That would look even like creepier, though. So what's been going on so far? Nothing. Nothing, bro. You didn't bring nothing to eat. <laughs> you hungry, bro? It's your first day, got food. <laughs> <laughs> you been see? Oh, you it's got, crazy. You got, you got a full full battery. I don't know. <laughs> you got one charger and four people. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> gonna be here all night. Have a long take, bro. All right, Joe. Cool, now we just wait. Hey. Alrighty, this is where the boring part starts. So I hope you guys got your snacks and your drinks because we're probably going to be here all night. I ain't got nothing to eat and I'm hungry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Except for you, I got some Triple J's over here. So you guys, we sat on Cesare Street for about an hour and a half before we actually got action. So for the guys who watch my videos, you know when we stake out, it is kind of boring, so I'm not gonna bore you guys to death. But basically all she did was pull into her driveway, get outside of her car, and she made her way into her house very slowly and slowly till she got to the door and she finally went in. 
Time passed on and we were still sitting here staking out. Her neighbors just moved a couple of trucks. More and more trucks moved and more people came and left. Something interesting finally happened when a white car pulled up and then Cesare came outside and delivered a baby to it like it was DoorDash and she went back inside of the house. Car ended up pulling out, then it got on out of here. Me and the guy sat in the car for about 45 minutes to an hour until this happened. Nice ass car coming through here right now. Oh, it's charging. He about to turn around too, cause it's a train right there. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Hold on. Okay. Any idea who this might be? He probably he could be going across the street, hold on. Oh, y'all get the fuck down. Make sure you don't see oh, Ricardo. He's going in there. Is that? Who is that? Bro, he just went to the house, dude. Who is that? Did you get, you got, you got a visual on that drip? Yeah, I got a clear visual on that. So we finally got action. A Dodge Charger ended up pulling to the crib. I immediately hopped on the phone to call Armand and informed him what was going on at his crib. Hello? Hey, Slim, how far are you away from the house? Bro, we got somebody here, so hurry up. Right now. Yeah, he's somebody's here. Say that. I'm on the way. All right. All right. <laughs> this shit is crazy. Crazy phone. Damn. So it's the charger, bro. The charger. So basically, bro, he um he parked his car right here. He just went inside the house. My, she opened the door. Yeah, he's a he's a bright guy. He, no, I don't. I, we can't even see that far because of the trees. But he's a bright guy. He kind of got like a short haircut. I don't think I know. So he kind of like he kind of like stocky. Hell no, nah, I don't know. I ain't anything. been here before because he just got on the trees. Oh, looks alive. What the fuck is this? What the fuck happened? What they here for? Hey, Dre, we got cops. You know they probably gonna pass us. Oh, they not, bro. They like coming in. Hey, be cool, fool. Are they coming for y'all? They came straight right in front of us. What the fuck? Bro, I got lit, bro. Let's hey, bro. nobody stop shooting, bro. Nobody stop shooting. Nobody do no dumb shit. Nobody move. We're literally sitting in the car talking about how we're about to actually go inside of the house, and out of nowhere, the cops pull up and start approaching us. Man, bro, what is they? they oh my god, bro. Come on, now, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Hey, Jim, sit tight. Make sure. They, we ain't did shit wrong, bro. Let's go in, bro. What doing now, bro? Let's go in, bro. How you guys doing? How y'all doing now? Uh, we got a call of a suspicious vehicle. What? And it seemed like you guys, what's going on here? What's, what's my man's doing his feet out like that? What's, what's happening? Oh, uh, so basically we, we're we like uh, private investigating for someone who like, reached out to me to-, to see cameras though, fam. Let me, let me talk to her real quick. Basically somebody reached out to me and trying to see if they significant other was loyal to them or not. So we basically like running surveillance right now. Okay, okay. Uh, Y'all have any type of identification or anything like that? Can you look down this back window for me? For well, what? Like, we ain't even doing nothing. Chill, Gabe. Like, bro, we chilling, bro. So, we. What you mean? Put my hands where you can see them, bro. We we'll chilling. We so in the car chilling, bro. Yeah, I just got a walkie talkie. Like, damn, city. we doing our job. You may be telling me, but I'm not quite sure. All I got is a suspicious call about a suspicious vehicle, and you guys ain't, ain't here crammed up like. But we ain't doing nothing. You so see, we ain't doing nothing. What's up with dude? Y'all chill, chill out. Dude, chill out. Hey, y'all chill out. Like they doing too much, bro. Man, you heard what he said, though, fam. Like, so, like I said before, let me talk, bro. Y'all chill out. So basically, like I said before, I have a YouTube channel. It's called Jack TV. Okay. People reach out to me all the time to see if they significant other are are being loyal to them. Okay. So I got a call like uh, two weeks ago about doing this right now. And now me and my team, bro. You see, he got a shirt on that say Jack TV. He's part of my crew. We just running surveillance right now at that house right here. What about your man's back here? He is the boy. Friend. Say, man, he I'm, reached out to me. Man, look, there's somebody in my house right now, bro. It is literally five guys crammed up into one car. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. We look so suspicious, and what I'm explaining to them don't make no sense right now, and they're not understanding. And on top of that, our mind got a whole nother guy inside of the crib right now that he's trying to get to. Where do you live? He lives right, right here. There. Okay. He just told you. Like, what's the problem? Can we do our job? I don't have. Y'all, y'all have to relax. Be cooperative. Are right, they tripping? Oh, no, they tripping. We don't got to give no ID, bro. We doing our job. My man's in the back with the security vest. He has, he has weapon. Yeah, yeah. No, he don't. No. Do me a favor. Step out. For what? Bro, just cooperate. Bro, nah, for what? We doing our job. We ain't got to step out. For what? Step out the car. Bro, they doing too much, bro. I'm about to move it. You ain't got to open the door, bro. I got it. They doing too much, bro. I got it. 
All right, come on, bro. Now they're going to... Now, 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 now. Can't be able to do our fucking job. Fit in this car. Look how big he is. So these are my camera oh, guys. They're going to film just for our protection. Whoa, whoa, and... whoa. We got three. My man. What? Hey, we just doing our job, bro. Oh, come bother us. Listen to bro, chill out. Chill out, Gabe. Oh, they bothering us, bro. My name is Jack. Jack? All right, Jack, come in. Let, let me talk to you. Like, right, God damn. We're filming the show, and it's his Bro, house. Bro, what? This is his house. Do you have any ID? Okay. I don't, what I need ID for? Do me a favor. No, I don't got ID. What's the problem? Hey, y'all chill. No. Okay. Oh, I ain't got to tell you my name, bro. We just we shooting the video. I'm messing the footage up. I ain't got to tell you nothing, bro. Like, what are you talking about? I ain't got to tell you nothing, bro. They blowing the cover. Like, come on, bro. Bro, I don't got, don't, bro. You ain't got to tell me, bro. You ain't got to tell me. Me, bro. Jack, nah, bro, for what? What's the problem? Hey, don't, don't stop rolling, bro. Don't stop rolling. Man, for what? Because I'm telling you, they've been telling you several times to chill out. Chill out for what? If they really trust Chill out for what? Hey, go find out what was that about. Make sure everything's good. Like y'all come up bars than us, bro. We ain't be doing nothing, bro. I ain't giving you nothing, bro. Don't tell him, bro. Don't tell me, bro. Don't tell me, bro. Come on, bro. Get off me. Now get get off me, bro. Gabe, you gotta chill. Bro, nah, bro. For what? We doing our job, bro. Bro, hey, dude. Everybody, everybody scared. Bro, whatever, bro. Get off me, bro. All right. Get off me, bro. Come on, bro. All right. Bro, come on now. Y'all doing too much. I know. Y'all doing too much, bro. I know. We shooting a video. I know. Like, come on, bro. Okay. Like, god damn, dog. For no reason, bro. Right. For no reason. Like, what y'all doing for no reason? Turn around. You gonna give us like, come on. ID? Ain't give you nothing. Do your, man, come on. I ain't do nothing. What? Do your job, bro. Do your job. All right. Do your job. What's your name? Don't worry about it. You're not gonna tell us your nah, name? Nah, don't worry about it. All right. Do your job. Right. Do your Let's job. Get prep to get into a Whatever. Get, go ahead. What, what you waiting hey, on? Hey, you gotta cooperate, nah, bro. Nah, bro. They doing too much, bro. You taking them to the car? Do whatever you want to do. Right. Do whatever you want to do. You wanted to touch me. I ain't want to touch you. Yeah, you know you want to touch me. Yeah. Okay. So right now, I'm going to give you a heads up, sir. We have a guy running inside the house. He's with inside right much. now, but it's another guy there messing with his wife. So okay. I don't want an altercation to be going on in there. That's what he was here for was my security. So I'm just letting you know that right now. All right. Well, one of our officers went. Okay. Hey, hey, homie. Get up out this motherfucker, bro. I don't know you. I told you, bro. You was being a man, my nigga. Fuck what she talking about. This my shit. This it's my, my shit, shit, nigga. I don't give a fuck. What's he talking about? This my it's shit, nigga. Get the fuck up out of here, bro. You, my nigga, you little niggas like this, bro. What you doing, bro? You, too. you got the nigga in here sitting on the couch and shit, my nigga. He chilling. He chilling. How long he been here? Fuck all that nigga. Why is he here? Why is he here? Why is he here? Why is he here, fam? What bills you been here? It don't fucking matter, nigga. What bills you been here? You got the nigga in here sitting on the couch and shit, my nigga. What the fuck you call the cops for? You talking too much. What the? I ain't talking too much, nigga. It's just a nigga in our house. What you mean? I don't gotta pay no motherfucking bills, nigga. I'm hitting that, nigga, not him. What fuck are you talking about? It's some people outside of my house. They been outside my house for a while. I don't know what so basically, he hired us to come run surveillance on you because he felt like you was being disloyal. Cause you, yeah, yeah obviously. No. Cause you nasty, nigga. Cause you nasty, nigga. <laughs> oh, you, it's funny. It's funny. It's funny. All right. All right. Yeah. Okay. 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 You got money for surveillance, but not bills. What's happening? Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't stay here. I thought I didn't stay here. I thought I didn't stay here. I ain't stay here. Yeah, homie. Yeah, homie. It's time to go, bro. It's time to go, bro. Homie. It's time to go, bro. Step out, nigga. He leaving. He leaving. We good. He's leaving. We good. Good. No, I'm not going no motherfucking well. You see he out this bitch, right? You see he out this bitch, right? So what, what you called us for what? Bro. Because of the people outside, all these cars. I don't even know these people. They just everywhere. Okay. So this whole entire time, Cesare was the one who called the cops because she said our cars outside was suspicious, which means our cover was blown way before we even knew it. And, and you brought him? Huh? Like I said before, he reached out to us. Because you cheat, bro. I, I, I been feel like you was cheating, bro. And you then you, then you cheating on niggas with five. You cheating on niggas. You cheating on me with niggas that's five four. <laughs> It's funny. It's funny though. It's funny though, bro. If this cop went here, I really slap the shit out you, bro. You know how I do. You know how I do. You know how I do. You can pay for Nah, you not fuck no, bro. You know how I do, bro. You know how, bro. Say, fam. And you and you laughing, bro. You lucky this nigga right here, bro. Hey, this guy, please, please, please. No, I ain't no, bro. He's gonna step out. You saying what it was, bro? You saying what it was, bro? And why dude still here though? Why dude still here though? Why you still here, fam? What's up? 
So what's hey. up, bro? Hey, fo, you, hey, hey, hey just, bro. just to keep hey, all keys, hey, out of respect, it's time to go, bro. Just, like, go it's time to now. go, bro. Um, hey, real talk. It's time to go, bro. Real talk. I don't, I don't even do that shit. I don't even get down like that, bro. It's time for you to, it's time for you to bounce, bro. It's time for you to step, fam. It's time for you to step, fam. It's time for you to step, fam. Yeah, out of respect. Nigga, I'm telling you, you gotta go, nigga. What you mean? I'm telling you, gotta go, nigga. I'm telling you, gotta go, nigga. Fuck up out of here, bro. I see you. Hey, hey, get him up out of here. Get him up out of here, though. Little ass nigga. Yeah, I don't want you getting no trouble, man. Can you get some clothes? I'm anything? good. All right, man. Man, fuck no, bro. Fuck no. I'm staying here. I ain't lying. I'm staying here, bro. I'm staying here, bro. I ain't going no fucking what. Y'all, she feel like y'all stocking her house. Ain't nobody stocking the house. She, he, he, he told you what it was, bro. He told you Yeah, we finna go. Is, is, is my guy going to jail? You, you guys actually talked to the officer over there, but as of right now, she feel like y'all stocking the house. You just, no, I'm saying it's my security getting detained. He's, he's detained right now. He's detained right now. <sighs> Uh, excuse me. What's up? I'm trying to figure out what's going on with him. He's going to go to jail tonight. He's going to jail? Yes. What is he going to jail for? He's going to go to jail for failure to ID. Give me, give me one second. For what? He's going good. to jail for failure to ID and interference with a public service. So that's public duty, I'm sorry. But I just believe he's going to jail for What? Well, uh, we told him several like times to like chill what? out, to back off. He has to put his license, his driver, any type of identification. He refused. We're just doing our job. Uh, That's it. Y'all come over bothering us. This is the end result. Like we doing something. We ain't doing, we ain't hurting nobody or nothing. So if you guys could do me a favor, just back up a little bit. Okay. I think you back up a little bit. Okay. You need, uh, you need yeah, you chill, up. you good, bro. All right. So, yeah, where y'all taking him? Can I get that mic off him? He got a mic on him. Sure. You good, bro? Yeah, I'm good. Okay, bro. Till next time. Jack off. <laughs> they crazy, but they really taking him to jail for no reason. Damn, this shit went crazy. This shit went left quick. Hey man, I'm gonna need y'all to say free some mini in the comments, man. It's not funny, but I'm just like, when I get like irritated, I kind of just smile, bro, because. Comment down in the comments if you guys actually believe that Gabe should have went to jail. I don't know why he actually went to jail. Like, I'm really confused, but free Gabe in the comments, man. That's tough. Like Smitty said, man. Until next time, jack off.